Coming up, he is the son of Sophia Loren, and now he's bringing music to children. Carlo Ponti is here in studio next on California Live. Danny, have you ever wondered what it would be like to be the daughter or the son of an iconic, of a movie icon? Oh my God, I could only dream. <laughs> I, my parents are great. They're great. Love you guys. But um, far away as you can get from yeah, Hollywood. Yeah, same here. Same here. <laughs> well, our next guest was born into Hollywood royalty. Carlo Ponti Jr. is the son of the legendary Sofia Loren and Italian film producer Carlo Ponti. Carlo, it's so great <laughs> to meet you and welcome to California Live. So Thank I got to ask you yeah. first, what was it like having to hugely famous parents. <laughs> yeah. Well, first of all, when you're actually born into this situation, you don't, you're not objective, yeah, so you don't realize right, yeah. of their fame. But uh, I've always been extremely proud of their, of their cultural legacy, uh, both uh, of my mothers and fathers. And to this day, you know, I'm so honored to be their son. Yeah. So great. Yeah. And so you took on music as your passion and you're a world famous conductor. Mm. And I love the work that you're doing with children. Can you yeah. please talk about bringing that classical musical influence in their life. Yes, I'm the founder of the Los Angeles Virtuosi Orchestra, which is based in uh, Los Angeles, and uh, is the only orchestra in the world, at least to my knowledge in the world, which allocates 100% of its net profits from the concerts to music education uh, in its partner schools. Wow. Yeah. And why was it so important for you to work with children and have it be brought back into the school systems? Well, I've always been a very big advocate of uh, supporting music education, of supporting the study of music throughout my career. And uh, I believe, you know, I really believe in the benefits of music education. Music education, to name but a few, fosters cooperation, collaboration, communication. Uh, it increases uh, the students' academic achievements, mostly in mathematics and in reading, so in key disciplines as well. And uh, I think that Los Angeles is an ideal way for such a project to be born because it is the second largest uh, school district in the country and it's one of often the most underserved in terms of music education yeah. mm -hmm. in, in the public schools. And they're removing a lot of those it. out of the schools, which right. is great. So. Yeah, and so you've got some concerts coming up, yes. right? Yes, yes. We have a very full season. This season we're branching out not only in Los Angeles but also uh, in South Bay. And uh, we have uh, a performance also in Orange mm -hmm. County this month. So our first performance will be uh, on October 17th mm -hmm. in Torrance okay. at the West High School Performing <laughs> Arts Center in Torrance. Uh, and we'll be performing, we'll be partnering with okay. the West High School in, in this performance and we'll be performing uh, a choral piece with the students of the West High School, of the choir of the West High School. And what's the uh -huh. response with the kids? I mean, are uh -huh. they totally into this classical movement? It's such, a, <laughs> such an interesting and different type of music, you know, for a genre for, for kids. Well, they've been, they've been really, really, I mean, this is their first performance of um, a piece with a professional orchestra. Yeah. And, and they've been extremely, extremely motivated. You know, it gives them the chance to really perform at the highest possible level, to be motivated at the highest possible level, and to show what they can achieve. And, uh, and it's been a great experience for, uh, for, for all of us involved. Such yeah. an inspiration for them, yeah. Yeah, I was about to say, do you still get excited over that? I was wondering, oh, like, yeah. do you still get like a little bit of butterflies before this stuff happens? I get very excited by seeing how the students react, react. You, know, yeah. you know, in this sense of, of you know, the discovery when they, when they see, you know, a piece of music, when they actually learn it, and the enthusiasm in which that they take upon a challenge. You know, and then, you know, they will practice at home and, and it shows them what they can achieve with motivation, with dedication. And, and, and in many cases, you know, I mean, regardless of if they want we to We hate make... to cut you off, but the show's going to end, but you're oh. such an inspiration. Thank you so much <laughs> Thank for everything you. that you do and go to our website.